about the death of a beautiful dancer with a peanut allergy who died after taking just one bite of a cookie. One of her fellow dancers is sharing details about her friend's final moments, including when she held her in her arms as she passed away. Jim Murray has our report. Heartbreaking new information about the professional dancer who collapsed and died after taking a single bite out of a cookie. This is video of the talented Orla Baxendale dancing alongside her friend Haley Jo Green, who is now revealing Orla's haunting final moments. I held her in my arms as she took her last breath moments before we arrived to the hospital. A true tragedy and a real-life nightmare. 25-year-old Orla was living out her dream as a professional dancer. She was with fellow dancers when she took a bite of a vanilla Florentine cookie from a box purchased at a Stu Leonard supermarket in Connecticut that did not list peanuts as an ingredient. Orla went into immediate anaphylactic shock. I spoke with Orla's roommate, Christine Flores, who today is in tears. She really brought uh, so much life to everyone around her. Orla and Christine had just performed together in a holiday production. What was your reaction when you heard that this package was mislabeled? It was honestly infuriating. She says Orla was hypervigilant about her severe peanut allergy. She carried around three EpiPens almost everywhere she went. Um, and yeah, she was super diligent about it. Orla's friends reportedly used the EpiPen on her, but her allergic reaction was so severe it couldn't save her. Allergist Akansha Gunju says it's imperative to know how to use an EpiPen correctly. The way I like to look at this is orange to the thigh, blue to the sky. She says take off the blue cap, then press the EpiPen, which can go through clothing, into the side of the thigh. You'll hear the click. You're going to hold it for three seconds. One, two, three. She also says Orla Baxendale was correct to keep more than one EpiPen on hand. There are instances that you might need more than one EpiPen. After three to five minutes, if you don't see improvement of your symptoms or your in symptoms are coming back, you do want to use your second, second EpiPen. Important tips as the dance world mourns the loss of a bright talent gone too soon. When using an EpiPen, doctors recommend you call 911. It is estimated that more than 6 million Americans are allergic to